Yeovil were comfortably sat in fourth in WSL 2 at kickoff here. Oxford was sat rather less comfortably, second from bottom. On paper it looked like a home win and that's how it panned out on grass at Rally Grove. The opener came 19 minutes in, spectacular stuff from Sarah Wilshire and so unlucky that Helen Blessed smashed home the rebound. There's only one promotion place available in WSL 2 this season. Sunderland looked to have that sewn up, but Yeovil are well placed in the pack just behind. And 12 minutes later here it was 2-0. Again Wiltshire involved, cutting it back perfectly this time. The arriving Ellie Curzon. Yeovil have won three of their last four. Oxford had lost all of their last seven, so it wasn't much of a shock to see the home side pull away after the restart. Having teed up the first two goals before the break, Sarah Wilshire scored one herself barely two minutes after it. It took her a couple of goes, but in the end she got it right. 3-0 and then 4. It really was the Sarah Wilshire show. How about that for a free kick? Oxford keeper Demi Lamborn might have done better. The last time Oxford didn't lose, it was the end of June. But that win over Durham must seem a long time ago. They went five down here when, inevitably, Wilshire crossed. The substitute Laura Bray made some room to find the corner. Plenty of quality about many of those first five Yeovil goals. The sixth, however, was a bit of a mess. Wiltshire's cross somehow being allowed to find its way into the net. A double hat-trick of sorts for her. Three goals and three assists to boot. The guests did manage one super effort on goal themselves, though. Louise Fellows with fabulous technique, but no luck at all. Rounding off another day to forget for Oxford. They finished the weekend at the very bottom of the WSL2 table, thanks to a rare win for the London Bees. Yeovil stay fourth, 6-0 the final score.